Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Hello everyone, Assalamu alaikum. Here is Diamond Star with her new vlog. And definitely, yes, I've been away from you guys for a long time because I was just busy in shifting my apartment and then I had some university commitments, so that's why. But today I am here and today I'm going to Buddha Castle and Fisher, Fisherman. So here we are waiting for the bus 105, which will take us to Buddha Castle and just check out the view. It's so awesome. I don't know bus kyu nahi aa rahi hai but we are waiting for a long time and uh, maybe we have missed the bus or what but still we are waiting so the bus has come and we have just come by this so everyone this is fisher's man bashan it's very famous place here so here i would like to show you some model and i think it's the same of this fisherman's passion So if we see the architecture and the building style everything is just so perfect and it's like it has been built a long time ago it was used in wars so everything is just perfect and let's go upstairs to discover more so basically this is the view from the top of the fisherman's bastion and here all the tourists are just busy in doing some photography and let me go further and then i can show you the main top of the building and how it looks like and here you can see the parliament so basically buddha castle and fisherman's passion is on the buddha side of the buddha pest so buddha pest as i have told you that it has two sides buddha and pest so this is the buddha side and i am standing at the top even the weather today is so much good and if i move around to give you a full view around me you can see and just see those lines in the sky like this is giving a very perfect location is basically their castle and it was like it has some history that it was very famous in and it was used in some war and i will like to like share with you some history it was written downstairs when i will go downstairs i will you know have a shot of that thing and i will share it with you so it's very famous and architecture wise it's just awesome place to take your pictures and to spend your evening here and you can just come here and have a coffee and this see it's so beautiful and as i've told you that from this place you can see a lot of places in budapest and as i have shown you that there was a, like danube you can have a full view of danube river plus the bridges and most importantly that you can see parliament which i have shown you and like here, here exactly this is parliament behind me exactly <laughs> As you all can see that this is a time of dusk so they have just lighted up all the lights and it is even giving more beautiful view because these are the yellow lights and this is giving very perfect view and in just few moments it will be like all dark here so these lights are actually depicting the color of their flag that is red white and green and this is how it looks like if you see it from the pest side and once again my all time favorite the parliament building it's looking so great at the night and everything has just lighten up and it's looking so good so now this is another part of the fisherman's bastion and now moving forward we will go towards the buddha castle so now we are moving towards buddha castle and at my back it's fisherman's bastion and bye bye fisherman bastion and now we are just heading towards buddha castle and we will just go by walk because it's too near and it's so beautiful the view is so beautiful at the night that we really want to walk ourselves because we we want to enjoy it just look around
So this is Buddha Castle and this is the place which was featured in the movie Jab Harry Met Sejal and this is the eagle and this is basically that gate where Shah Rukh Khan and Anushka Sharma had like they are posing here and obviously we all are going to take pictures here now and we will be posting on our social media that the place when Harry Met Sejal this and that. <laughs> So this is the front of Buddha castle and I'm just standing in front of the light so my face is just glowing too much otherwise the lighting is not that much good because it's almost night time. So as you can see behind me there is some sculpture and it is looking very nice actually and this is the front of Buddha castle. Actually it is very much cold right now so that's and just across uh, this building there is Danube directly I can show you that. Once again that building is parliament and then again this is whole Danube river so this is the dome of Buddha castle and this is how it looks like by the night so here we are going further inside This place used to contain a lot of coins but right now there is not even a single coin present so I think the Hungarian government has started some new business with those coins so it used to be filled with water basically and then people used to make some wishes here and used to throw some coins but unluckily unfortunately right now there are no coins and no water <laughs> and this is some other entrance and after that they charge 2000 rupees uh, for students to go inside and then you can have a proper tour of the Buddha castle like in, inside because the outside is all free you can just roam around and you can enjoy yourself but if you want to go inside and you want to see it from there you need to pay the price of the ticket and if you are a student do remember to take your student card with you so that you can enjoy the discount okay so that is not 2000 rupees that is 2000 forints like the uh, information which i have given you so this was all about my today's vlog i hope you all liked it i myself enjoyed very much here and if you have any questions if you want to ask any specific thing about hungry you can write down in the comment section don't forget to subscribe my channel and like the video allah hafiz